I'm on the final steps of the puzzle, the geared puzzle, and I want to show the frame and some of the uh, changes I've made. Um, I've cut the frame down a few millimeters, made it a little tighter so that all the blocks uh, fit together. Uh, I'll address the gear issue later, but I think I've resolved that as well. Um, so this is just the frame tightened up so the blocks fit better, and then uh, in addition to that I have to change the position of the, the drive gear and the, the free spinning gear. Uh, so both of these were cut off and then the frame was cut apart, uh, trimmed down, and then welded back together. And then you can see this kind of this pattern uh, throughout. Those are welds I'll show you in, the, in a little bit on the back. And then you can see the uh, magnets here, here, you know, there's 16 of them. I'm missing a couple on the bottom, I have to buy a few more. Uh, but the frame is assembled, and then the motor will be here, and then the free spinning gear there. And then here's the back side. I reinforced it with a piece of angle iron, because once I started tacking all um, these little guys here, these are little steel plates that I welded that hold the magnets, um, otherwise the magnets will pop through the back. So. I drill through this piece of steel, weld on this little uh, backer here so the magnet can sit in the larger steel plate and sit not quite flush but just enough to stay in place and then the magnet holds it here. I think that'll be fine if I need to put some epoxy in I'll do so but I don't think it's necessary. Um, there's not that much of a pull in the surface area of the plate here is larger than the the steel connection on the panels so it sticks here pretty good. Um, I've also welded uh, the back plate to this piece of angle iron because it did warp and kind of bubbled outward which makes the panels a lot harder to stick together. Um, that's all I'm going to show for right now. I'm going to go ahead and put the panels back together, slide them all in place, and I'll show a video of, of the gear issue that I what I did to solve that. And uh, I'm gonna have to sand some things and I have to I wanna play with it for about a week and uh, get everything loosened up and it should uh, should move a lot smoother then.